Uh, this will be my second video. It's talking about the gas station craze. For you don't don't know what I'm talking about. It's whenever you walk into a gas station and you go to the checkout aisle and they got these plastic boxes right here, just filled with uh, crazy looking uh, legal drugs. You know, if, if you've seen Sleepwalker, Limitless. They got this new thing called Adderall XR. It's Adderall without the ER. And the pills are orange and white. And it looks just like Adderall Extended Release. Um, it's ridiculous. It's blowing up and crazy. And that's actually in my last video where I showed you the Zaza Red. Um, that's where I got it. It's the stuff at the gas station at the road. They were $30. These gas station pills are the new drug that people are getting off on because they i know that a lot of people who might come across this video have heard of sleepwalker or maybe even new sleepwalker it's finiba or finibute one of those it's, it's you know it's called one of those um finiba and it's just that with caffeine and some other type of shit in it and you know you if you've ever done finiba you can get fucked up on that shit uh, the tying up team, which is ba w w mixed with cava, so that that makes it even more like a narcotic. Cause I've explained how I got a feeling that was stronger than Percocets, and now at the gas station you're able to come across CBD weed everywhere. From you'll see these, it's always in green and black bags, like um, edibles, oils, vape juice, jewel pods straight up bud like it's it's very popular now blowing up and a lot of people uh older you know middle-aged people are starting to purchase on it now because a lot of them in where i live don't like to do illegal shit so it's very it's getting popular because of it's helping with anxiety and it's just these gas station drugs that you can find are insane like i some of them that i go to they they have marijuana cigarettes which it's just CBD marijuana. It's not legal in Alabama where I live. Um, it's crazy, and it's starting. It, it and the other thing is, is that I'm eighteen. You know, I'm not able to uh, really. The the the, the, the Zaza has on the back of it that you must be twenty one years old or older, twenty one years or older to purchase it. I I got it. They didn't ID me. I had the sleepwalker, they didn't ID me. You're not you're supposed to be a certain age to buy that shit. And you know, if if any just fifteen year old or sixteen year old can walk in you know, they walk in there and buy that shit. It's gonna start an early craze with people taking these sleepwalker pills and taking these tie and up team pills. And I've already talked about the withdrawals with tie and up team. I've already taken more do being the retarded person that I am. Um they you know especially for you know i i i know what i'm getting myself into some people might not and they might start taking this without ever experiencing withdrawal effects and then they get cut off randomly because i don't see tying up team being legal much longer uh it's too similar to kratom it's similar to opioids and you know you know they don't like that shit it's something that they're trying to regulate with the opioid ed epidemic in america but this gas station craze is insane. You can pick up all types of shit in these gas stations and pass drug tests and fake pee. It's it's crazy. The gas station uh, the gas stations are starting to look more like head shops. You know, I, I know y'all have all walked into that one gas station that's just got a ton of bongs and pipes and fucking crack pipes sitting there, like right there just to purchase. It's it's. It's it's really strange and a big change, especially for the non FDA approved medic meds that they're selling, uh, because Finiba and these tying up team both have wicked withdrawals, and I don't know, I I I, I don't know, like I'm not I'm not okay with it. I'm just kind of addressing it, just I have something I felt like talking about because I know other people have seen this stuff in the gas stations and. I don't know how much longer it'll last. The CBD really is taking off, uh, which is, to me, it makes me happy because I feel like that's another step closer to getting recreational marijuana. So yeah, I just wanted to make this video about the gas station craze. And 
yeah, I hope y'all enjoy it. I'm starting to get into making videos more just because I, I spent, I used to spend a lot of time just making ideas for YouTube videos in my head, but never actually making them, and now I'm just saying fuck it and making it. So yeah, I hope y'all enjoy it. Leave a like, subscribe, please, and later.